Okay, let's go over this question. 13 minus square brackets negative uh, 5 minus 12 in parentheses minus 3 square bracket minus 7. Okay, so we want to think about our order of operations again. PEMDAS, we need to do parentheses, then exponents, then multiply or divide from left to right, then add or subtract from left to right. Okay, so um, let's see. Again, remember the square bracket is just another type of parenthesis. You might as well have another parenthesis there. It just looks nicer because it's different than, than this curved uh, parenthesis. But it's another type of grouping symbol. It doesn't mean anything uh, different, right? Um, so we do parentheses first. So the first parentheses you come across is the square bracket. But inside there, there's more parentheses. So we kind of do the innermost parentheses first, right? So we figure out 5 minus 12. So let's just figure out 5 minus 12. That's your first step. And then just write everything out the same. So you've got $5. You subtract $12. And what do you have now? Or you can do your blam blam, 5 plus negative 12, 5 good guys and 12 bad guys makes 7 bad guys, right? And now just write everything out the same. So just do one calculation and write it all out. Be patient, there's no rush. If you make one mistake, you're wrong. So there's no rush, right? Um, so going from left to right, again, we do what's inside the parentheses. So we go inside the, the square brackets here, right? And inside there, we've got a negative, negative 7, then minus 3. Now, negative, negative, we can change that to plus, plus. Subtract a negative, a debt of 7, it's like giving you $7. If you, if you cancel a bill, it's like giving money, right? So inside here, we have a positive 7 minus 3. 7 minus 3 is... Four. You should work out the inside of this thing to wind up being 4. So now we got 13 minus 4 minus 7. Okay. So again, follow order of operations. Go from left to right, add or subtract from left to right. Okay. Um, if you just subtract there, you just you got to start with the 13 minus 4 to give 9 and then 9 minus 2 um, gives 7, right? You cannot do 4 minus 7. By the way, just a little tip. You can't go 4 minus 7 equals negative 3. The reason is, why? Why can't you do that? Because this is in fact a negative 4, not a positive 4. You can't assume that to be a positive 4. It's not a positive 4. Okay, so just be careful there. So we can subtract from left to right. So we'll do it, we'll do it two ways. We'll subtract from left to right. 13 minus 4. Remember that's a minus 4, not a positive 4. 13 minus 4 is 9. And 9 minus 7 is 2. So that's going from left to right. The other way to understand this, and I do want you all to understand things, as you know, is um, um, like you can do your blam blam thing. So you can go like change the subtractions to plus negative, plus negative, because now it says you know 13 plus a negative 4 plus a negative 7. So it's 13 good guys, 4 bad guys and seven bad guys. And if you combine all those guys together, you get, you end up with just two good guys left over, right? 